Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. As you all know, pollution is at its peak, especially in Delhi. We are literally living in a gas chamber. And, you know, apart from all the bad effects that pollution has on our health, it also affects our skin. So in this video, I'm going to talk about some products which will help you uh, combat the effects of pollution and, uh, you know, help you maintain your glowing skin and minimize the effects of pollution on your skin. So if you're interested in knowing what all products I'm using to save my skin from the harmful effects of pollution, keep watching. Also, if you're new here, please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and do give this video a thumbs up if you like it. And now let's get started with my anti-pollution product recommendation. Now, as always, the first step towards any good skincare regime is a good scrub. And the one that I'm using is the St. Ivy's Radiant Skin Pink Lemon and Mandarin Orange Scrub. This one, it polishes away dullness and it is for radiant skin. It is paraben free, oil free and dermatologist tested. It's a big huge tube so it's going to last you a good number of days. So this is America's number one scrub brand. Now it has a very uh, delicious citrusy uh, fragrance to it because of the pink lemon and mandarin orange. It contains 100% natural exfoliants to polish away dryness and you know give you that nice glowing skin. I personally really love this scrub. It's, you know, it's not very gentle, but it's not very harsh. It's a moderate kind of a scrub, uh, you know, the kind of scrubbing effect on your skin. So it's a, it's a cream based uh, scrub. So you just massage the scrub into your face and you get that nice scrubbing effect. It does not dry out your skin like, you know, other very harsh scrubs, but it gives you a nice, um, you know, scrubbed effect. Your, your skin feels squeaky clean after using this one. So definitely a must try, especially in this weather because it does not, you know dry out your skin excessively now you're not going to scrub your face every day of course uh, a scrub is to be used twice a week maybe uh, maybe thrice a week but not more than that so on the days when you're not using a scrub or you know if you've used the scrub in the morning you need something to clean your face in the evening for that I'm using this Kaya activated charcoal anti-pollution face wash now charcoal as we all know is, is known to attract all the dirt and pollution from the skin and and leave you with really clean skin so this anti-pollution face wash with activated charcoal is a definite must-have for you if you want uh, clean skin and if you want to combat the effects of pollution on your skin. This one has activated bamboo charcoal which has excellent absorption properties. It is a black colored face wash like this. Any anti-pollution skincare regime is incomplete without a good mask and the one that I'm currently using is this color bar charcoal rescue anti-pollution mask. It exfoliates, it de detoxifies your skin and it restores your uh, skin's balance. It is 94% natural, paraben and sulfate free and it is dermatologically tested. It is a thick black mask and it comes with a small brush like this which makes application really easy. I just directly apply the mask and let it rest on my skin and then 10 to 15 minutes I leave it on and then I wash it and uh, you can see that your skin feels firm. It also feels great and you know that you know you use something which is going to um, you know help you fight the effects of pollution on your skin. Now a good moisturizer is something we all definitely need all around the year but especially when you're fighting pollution you need to create a good barrier with a moisturizer on your skin so that you know all the harmful pollutants don't really uh, attack your skin. So a good moisturizer is really really essential and the one that I'm using is this rice ceramide moisturizer from the face shop. It is a gel, I, you, I don't know if you can see but half of the tub is already over. It is a gel cream like uh, moisturizer and really effective in moisturizing but it does not give you that uh, sticky feeling on the skin while it hydrates. Uh, this is a really good product and I've been using it daily. It does not have any SPF so I use it uh, in the night also. Last but not the least a good sunscreen is really really important all around the year but especially important at this time because you're fighting pollution. The sunblock that I'm using is this Lotus Herbal Safe Sun Ultra Protect Sunblock. It has SPF of 100 and PA triple plus highest UVA and UVB protection that you can get and uh, it is anti-aging and anti-tan product preservative free it has soy proteins thyme and licorice extracts which are good for your skin only thing that I feel is that it is a tinted product I'm wearing it uh, on my face right now and this is all that I'm wearing on my skin at the moment there's no other foundation concealer nothing uh, so you can see that it is working fine for my skin but um, I would definitely say that if you 
if you have a deeper skin tone than mine then you will need a uh, you know a foundation or a concealer matching your skin tone to go on top of this but if you are somebody who is of a skin tone similar to mine then you can definitely use it on its own i've been using it on its own ever since i got it and i haven't had the need to wear any other foundation on my face especially if i'm just you know casually going out this is all that i wear if you have deeper skin tone than mine then you will need something to uh, make the tint work for you so that was it guys those were my top recommendations towards fighting pollution and its effects on your skin i hope you guys enjoyed this video all product links are going to be in the description box down below as always i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did do give it a big thumbs up do subscribe to my channel for more and i'm going to see you guys in the next one bye